All right, guys, do you see this weather? We're going out to a grocery store in Japan when it's looking like there is a typhoon, but not really, but it looks like it. It's lightning, uh, no thunder yet, just a bunch of rain. So guys, we have a 7-Eleven. You see that? In Japan, the first one. We're gonna try to go inside, record a little bit, I don't know. Guys, so we can't go to 7-Eleven because it's not open yet. It opens on 7-Eleven. Thanks to her. She knows all the Japanese, I don't. <laughs> guys, so it's me and my friend KM, and we're Hi. about to go to Hamby Town. She's gonna do the challenge of how much can you buy in Japan with $25 or 2,500 yen. So, what do you think you're gonna be buying? before we go in. Um, rice? <laughs> of course, you're in of Japan. Course. And... Um, mm. Meat. Okay. Shrimp. Oh, Hopefully. you're getting shrimp? Yes. Oh, she's buying shrimp with $25? We, we just gotta go in and you gotta, gotta <laughs> see what we buy because I, I think she's gonna be adding this on her phone or something <laughs> so she doesn't go over. There's taxes here, so yeah, like 8%. <laughs> yes, we'll see. 8%. So, root for her. Give this video a thumbs up if you think she can get everything that she needs for 25 bucks in Japan or 2,500 yen. See you inside. Okay, so just in case you're curious, this is what 1,000 yen looks like in Japan. It's just basically like $10 and then two of those 2,000 yen which is like $20 and then a 500 yen piece which is $5 you can see that okay all right here we go in the rain and everything guys <laughs> right, guys so she just picked up the 9.98 rice because microwavable rice costs it's what like sometimes two bucks oh here we go so here it's 298 for three packs of microwavable rice this is what I buy all the time microwavable rice but not her all right guys so she wants this 280 but I don't know we'll see if it fits in the budget we're not gonna put it in the cart yet 1100 okay we need to keep a towel considering this chicken to go with the rice but we're unsure of how many pieces are inside so, one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve yep it's about 12 pieces inside that's what i think this stuff is really good if you're on a budget this mm -hmm. yep yep On to the next one. All right guys, so we just used Google Translate to see what this is. And this is vacuum squid with a dressing Chinese style. So I don't know. We're still thinking if she's gonna get this or not. And then she also has taco, which is squid octopus here in Japan. You like it? I'm not sure what to do with this. She said, I'm not sure what to do with this. Oh. Should I eat it like this? Because it has... Is that mustard? Miso. Miso? Miso. Okay. Alright, so, so far, it's just it's chicken and rice. Think. So far. Because it's cheap. I think what's cheap is hamburger or chicken. I love getting crab. Ocean King Crab. This stuff is good. But we're, this does not make the cut. But I eat that for fun. Like, or put mayonnaise, mix it with mayonnaise and put it on a lettuce wrap. That's good. So we're at 1764. She is going. To, it's fish. So already seasoned, marinated fish for 268. Looks yum. And it was right here beside this fish. <laughs> okay. 
No, I don't eat food like this, guys. But she was actually looking at this $4.98 squid on a stick. But because it's $4.98, it's too close to the budget, so we are putting it back. I'm actually considering this mm -hmm. because this looks like back for the book. Like Two eighty-seven. Two hundred eighty-seven, and you have one, two, three, four pieces. And she uh, should do fish. it. Thumbs up. She should do it. Let's go. <laughs> she might do it anyway. Two eighty-seven, and it's already prepared. Fish. I guess you're a big fish eater, huh? You like to have fish like maybe three or four times a week. Yes. Oh. Okay. Wow. I eat fish like maybe once or twice a week. That's good. Here we are in the milk section. So how much do I have? Even the sweets look so good. Tempting. It can fit in her budget, but we don't know. Two thirty-eight. So she has about four dollars left to spend. This is soba. It can fit in the budget, but we're not gonna buy it. It's three eighteen. for water guys it is 94 yen so we added that in and we're at what's that say 21 45 guys she's doing pretty good shopping with 25 bucks better than me I'm shopping with five dollars so let me show you guys 500 yen and I picked up I'll show you the card because this is all I came to the store with because I didn't plan on buying anything. Look at this. Look how much money the soup costs. $3.58. Minestrone, is that how you say it? Minestrone soup? I love this soup, but $3.58? No way. That's like restaurant quality. Oh, let me show my what I'm buying for $5 real quick. All right, so I have a bar, a yogurt bar. A grapefruit juice, 100 yen, 100 yen, and Greek yogurt. A lot of yogurts in here. That's what I have. So hopefully I don't go over five bucks. We found a dollar section. Wait, wait. Um, can you like um, yeah, cereal? Yeah. Like legit cereal. From where? Here? Yeah. This is cereal, right? Choco, choco flakes, like chocolate flakes. I like these. Roasted peanuts and chocolate, but not keto friendly at all. All right, so we're down to 21 something, so she has to buy some dessert or some sweets, so we're trying to see what can fit in the budget, and we're almost done. I don't know what else we're gonna do. Almonds and Manuka honey, oh my gosh, my favorite. I love this. You guys are wondering what they have. One of my students brings this a lot. Should I say? Because it's cheap. Yeah. I was wondering why he brought that all the time, but it's 100 yen and you get a lot. The bag mm -hmm. feels heavy. Yep, heavy bag. I do get that popcorn. I pay a dollar for each bag of popcorn. $1, 100 yen for a bag of popcorn in Japan. So she's gonna grab the cheddar cheese combos, which are already in the cart. And we found some Oreo Krispies for $2.28. So I think that puts her right at her budget. <laughs> Should she buy these guys? Let's, let's go to the register. I think we have everything we need to have. I think be getting this, but this is just amazing. Yeah, exchange. she could have gotten the 168 version, but she's getting the 228. So what I'll do is I'll let you buy all. Oh, I forgot to add in the water. I think. 
I don't know. I'll let her buy her stuff first, and then since I only have 500 yen, if I need to put one thing back, I'll be putting this back and give her two dollars or 200 yen towards all of her Japanese groceries at the grocery store shopping in Japan. Honestly, this is my guilty pleasure right here. I buy these from mm -hmm. time to time. M&M awesome? Krispies. I love it. Yes. Tastes exactly the same too. Yuppers. Now for some Kit Kat montages. Came to 328. Four. Okay. Oh my god. I went over. 26.53 went over. But luckily I have some extra money. So it's okay. Okay, did we fail the challenge? Because it was a little over. It was 26.56. But we got all the stuff. Woo! And a bag. Oh, thank you. Bye -bye.